The European Union is seeking to be um, a balanced, uh, supportive uh, diplomatic actor in Central Asia. When I say balanced, I mean balanced as between um, energy supply interests, security route through to Afghanistan interests, um, political human rights interests. They're all in there in the package of activities that the EU um, is engaged upon. Energy supplies and human rights are, are, are quite often not easy uh, bedfellows. Um, and so it's a, a constant issue for um, diplomats to uh, decide really um, what, what to do. Um, in reality, the European Union sustains these days a human rights dialogue with all five countries of the region. Uh, but it has to be said that this is only uh, significant or only really engaged in the cases of Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan and uh, Tajikistan. In the case of Uzbekistan and Turkmenistan, this is a highly formal and not very pleasant attempt at human rights dialogue um, because of the leadership of, of those two countries. Now, at the same time, um, Turkmenistan has all of this gas, and so it's a huge uh, issue for um, NGOs and human rights NGOs as to whether to um, seek to attach some Turkmen gas to the Nabucco pipeline is um, contradictory or having anything, any impact on, on the human rights uh, regime within Turkmenistan. Um, I don't find myself convincing the argument of uh, various um, human rights NGOs, which is saying that uh, to open up um, a Western gas pipeline across the Caspian Sea is going to uh, do anything much to the human rights situation within Turkmenistan.